Hello everyone, welcome to BLT's Bible on Life Talks with Brian Corey. I am so glad that you are with me on today. Listen, tomorrow is Easter Sunday. It is Resurrection Day. It is the day that we celebrate the death, the burial, and the resurrection of Jesus Christ. And so on today, I just want to leave us with this thought. Get up and get out. The Bible lets us know that Jesus was crucified on Friday. He was placed in the tomb and he rose again on Sunday morning. The getting up has to do with an awakening that takes place. Every morning, you and I, we wake up, we get up. It, it, it represents us in a state or in a position of rest in which we now become alert to what's going on around us. We now become present in our every day-to-day -day activities. We are awaking, we are aware, we are cognizant of what's going on around us. And I believe that as Christians, there's a point in our lives where we wake up. That there's a point in our lives where we actually get up and we actually realize that God has more for us. That, that we don't have to settle for second best. That the God that we serve has thoughts that surpass our understanding and really wants to do more than what we can even ask, think, or imagine. Get up, because he got up. Not only does the Resurrection Sunday represent the fact that he got up, but it represents that he got out. You see, the, the, the Bible lets us know that there was a stone that was placed in front of the tomb. So when Jesus arose, he not only got up, but he got out. And because he got up and because he got out, we can get out of our current situations as well. It's through the power and the blood of Jesus Christ that we can free ourselves, that we can become free from those things that have us bound, those things that have us trapped in, those, those past relationships, those past hurts, those things that haunt us, those things that we regret, those things that we look back on and we say, man, if I had only did this different, those things that are holding us back, those things that keep us in a place of confinement. You see, God doesn't just want us to get up. He doesn't just want us to, to awaken and find ourselves walking around in a tomb. No, 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 no. He wants us to get up and he wants us to get out. Because as we get out of that place, as we get out of that position, that we now find ourselves operating in purpose. We now can complete the assignment. You see, because when Jesus got up and he got out, when he got out, he was able to present the atoning sacrifice of his blood to the Father. It's on the other side of the tomb. It's on the other side of our situations that we find ourselves walking in purpose and we find ourselves walking in destiny. So I want to encourage us. I want us to know that because he got up and because he got out, we can get up and we can get out too. Thank you so much for joining me for BLT, Bible and Life Talks with Brian Corey. I'm so glad that you were here today, but I always look forward to talking to you soon. You take care. Peace.